Hello students today we are going to start our new chapter chapter 2 integers before starting this chapter first of all definition of integers or what are integers that should be clear to us now first of all what are integers integers are the collection of whole numbers and the negative of all natural numbers is known as the integers so in this we can say all the negative numbers zero and all the positive numbers are included the collection of all these numbers is known as the integers from the number line also you can see this is a number line on the left of the number line all the negative numbers are there on the right of the number line all the positive numbers are there and in the center or in the middle you can see zero they have written so all the negative numbers on the left side and all the positive numbers on the right side and zero is also there this is your number line from number line it is very clear that negative numbers are smaller than the positive numbers even negative numbers are smaller than zero also that is zero is greater than negative number so we are going to start with the exercise now exercise 2.1 in this the first question is in each of the following pairs state which integer is greater two numbers are given to you or two integers are given to you we have to tell which one is greater in this first is 0 and minus 34 so which is greater now only i have told you 0 is greater second part minus 34 and minus 1 which one is greater in this minus 1 is greater third case 23 and minus 76 in this 23 is greater last part very easy 12 and 14 so in this 14 is greater question number 2 in each of the following state which integer is smaller in the previous question we have done which is greater in this what we have to tell which is smaller minus 2 and minus 3 so which is smaller minus 3 is smaller second part 10 and minus 10 which one is smaller in this minus 10 is smaller third part minus 12 and 34 very easy minus 12 is smaller last part 51 and 15 so which one is smaller 15 is smaller all right children before starting the third question one thing you have to write at the side of your notebook that is plus plus is equals to plus then plus minus is equals to minus minus plus is equals to minus and minus minus is equals to plus it means whenever we are multiplying these two signs plus 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 whenever we are multiplying plus minus it will be always equals to minus minus plus minus 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 plus third question use a number line to evaluate each of the following first question given to you plus 6 plus minus 2 first of all we will simplify it plus 6 means 6 only plus minus what i have told you plus minus is equals to minus so write minus then 2 now we have to solve this on the number line we will draw first of all a number line in the middle 0 on the right side all the positive numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 <laughs> on the neg on this left hand side all the negative numbers minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 4 and minus 5 Now which number is given to you first of all 6 find out where is 6 here from 0 to 6 draw a line and draw the arrow like this from 0 we are going to 6 so arrow head should be like this next is minus 2 it means we have to subtract 2 subtract 2 means we have to move towards the left hand side so 1 and 2 here we have got whatever we have got the number we will circle that number what number is this 4 So we will draw a long line from here to here to six, and draw the arrowhead towards this side, and we will write minus two. Next is second part, minus three minus plus two. 
Next, minus 3. What is minus plus again? Minus plus is minus. So, minus 3 minus 2. We will solve on the number line. Draw a number line. Similar we have solved in the first part. So, first part, first number is minus 3. So, we will move from 0 to minus 3. We have moved from 0 to minus 3. So, arrowhead should be like this. Then minus 2. It means we will move two numbers ahead. So, 1 and 2. Circle this number and draw two big lines and join them. And arrowhead should be like this. Third part of the same question. It is minus 1 plus minus 5. Again, minus 1 we will write as it is. Plus minus minus 5. So, draw a number line. We will first of all move to 0 to minus 1. 0 to minus 1. And then minus 5. Minus means again we will move towards the left hand side. So count 5 numbers starting from minus 2. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Circle this number. Draw a line. Draw arrowhead. Last part of this question. Plus 5 minus minus 5. Solve it. Plus 5 minus minus plus. Plus 5 will come. Then draw a number line. Move from 0 to first of all 5. So I have moved from 0 to 5 and arrowhead should be like this. Next we have to move 5 digits forward. Plus 5 means towards right hand side we will move. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Circle this number and draw a line from here. So hope you have understood these 5 questions beta. Next we are going to start from the 4 to the next questions in the next video. Thank you.